Hey everybody, it's Becca J. Welcome back to my channel. We're masking again today. This is the Tony Moly Pore Care. I'm real. The Red Wine Mask Sheets. Yay. This one is Red Wine Mask Tightens Uneven Skin Texture with Enlarged Pores. Okay, now they're not really advertising like the anti-aging and wrinkle stuff and the collagen because, well, the red wine on your skin doesn't work like that. You have to ingest it more for those sort of health benefits. Um, <laughs> not a lot. You don't need a lot. Okay, <laughs> but this is for the enlarged pores and skin texture which you know I need some help with today so the directions they're extremely simple tear open apply to face leave on 20 to 30 minutes then remove okay so let's get to that red wine is actually an ingredient it's a wine extract there's a bunch of flower extracts and a fragrance so it should actually smell really good. So let's get it open. Okay, let's get that whiff. It smells really good. It doesn't smell bitter. To me, like, you know, red wine smells bitter to me. But this smells almost neutral. I can't smell like a whole lot. I don't know. It doesn't have much of a smell. Okay. Small, thin sheet mask. Paper material. There's no defining texture on either side to represent that there would be a front or a back, so either side is fine. It's very, very cold. This one has extra slits right here. And here to help get a better fit, even right here. I like that. There's just none right here on the bridge of the nose. Whew. It's cold. <laughs> it's a cold beast. Nice, very nice wide band for the upper lip. And I almost feel like the chin slit is not necessary either, but it's a nice little extra. So that being said, the coverage is decent. Two finger spaces here, two finger spaces uh, between the mask and the earlobe. So less of the chin and jawline, the jawline is covered less. No, with no slit at the bridge of the nose, the fit is a little difficult there. The eyes, I guess I could bring it down a little bit. They could have come down just a little bit more, but I understand they want you to get your under eye area real well, but like I said, it's right here on the side it's a little too close and I always feel like my eyelashes catch okay so this is a 20 to 30 minute mask so I will be back I think for this one I'm gonna lay down because as it dries and evaporates these will start to peel forward it's unusual for a Tony Moly mask but I'm having issues getting a good adherence I think it's because it does have the extra slits that it wants to shift around a little bit more and wrinkle up on me. And now that it's on my face, it smells absolutely delicious. It smells like a winery. I can smell uh, like flowers. I guess a little of the bitterness, excuse me, from the wine. smells like a vineyard 
without the wood. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, so I did the whole 30 minutes. That rooster is going off again. I swear, oh, we're going to eat chicken tonight. I don't even have to go to the grocery store. Hmm. So, I did the whole 30 minutes, and as it dries or evaporates, um, it does peel off, which is fine. It's always right here that goes first. Uh, remained real cool the whole time. Um, I actually was able to kind of recline. I didn't have to go in the bed and lay down, but I couldn't sit up all the way. Um, I was able to catch up a little bit on my Netflix. So, uh, But it is peeling off. It's ready, so let's just pop it off. Going to massage it around a little bit. Didn't say that on, you know, the instructions, but it's what you do is kind of massage it around and tap it in. So it does still have a tack. <laughs> That's okay. That will dissipate as the essence dissipates also and is absorbed. Um... Not really seeing a difference on my pores. They still look enlarged. They don't look, you know, full and gunky, but they're still pretty big. I just have large pores here and here, and they still look like that. Um, but I do believe my complexion looks a little more refreshed, a little more even. The texture of it, it is smoother. Yeah. It feels much better. It's just, you know, like I said, I didn't see any poor size improvements. Um, I'm also not dried out, but I'm not, like, drenched, you know, so I'm nice and moisturized. Um, I'll be able to go on with my day. Uh, I don't even know if I'm going to wear makeup today. You know, I haven't really worn it in, like, Two weeks. Well, I tried out a foundation, but that was it. Yeah, I've been going barefaced for two weeks. I don't even know if I know how to put on eyeshadow anymore. So yeah, <laughs> and it's funny. Like my my face, my skin, it's still that cold feeling. But yeah, it does look a little brighter and refreshed. So I'm sure it did something. I'm just not seeing like an immediate difference. But it did feel good. It smelled good. You know, for a 30 minute mask, you would think you would see some sort of miraculous change. I've seen changes instantly. Not instantly, but you know, with other masks, I have seen changes just in 15 minutes and a difference. And this one... I'm not really noticing much, but it did feel good. Um, yeah. It might be one of those to where, you know, you can use long term or multiple uses. Like if I used it all week or all month, if it was my one choice, I would see a difference. But I'm just not seeing it right now. Okay, so I will put the link to it down below or at least the website to where I did pick it up. So if it's not available there, you can find it on Google or browse around the place to where I got it because they they have a lot of sheet masks, um, a lot of sales, and really great customer service. I really enjoy them. Um, mm, it's not so bad after all. I mean, it's nice and smooth. Um, yeah, I feel good about it. Alrighty. If you have it, you want it, you love it, you hate it, let me know. If you've tried it, you know, let me know what you thought because um, I'm always interested in seeing how or hearing how things work out for you compared to me because, you know, uh, different skins, different people, different opinions. And I like that. It's, uh, it's what I tell my son, you know, there's that's why there's so many choices out there in life because not everybody 
is okay with the same thing. You, you know, we don't all have to like the same thing and it doesn't always work the same for everybody. So, you know, we got options. Okay. <laughs> Bye. Good job, Mom. Don't forget, click, click, like, subscribe.